Right, we're on the road for our first time, and because I just absolutely pay some bounty in the police station. Even I just absolutely started to support Japan, and all of this way that we're gonna be trying to do anyways. But let's start the road trip in some kind of a interstate highway for just as well. It's not just an interstate, that was some kind of autobahn is gonna be taking for very much as literally as possible. Before I might gonna be heading now for this seriously. There is my Honda Odyssey as well for the year 2003. So it looks like I just gonna be started to drive all the way up as literally fast as possible. Before it's just gonna be making it to this out. Maybe I'm not gonna be contact to some other kinds of people as literally as well. So if this is absolutely gonna be staying all right. Now let's gonna be head up and started for the journey and looks like in this previous video we just absolutely didn't able to have some old cars with this way so i suggest we're gonna be taking on smooth road trip as well to take it all the way around as we never gonna be slightly the end of this road unless we're gonna be reached up to 3000 rpm and it looks like i just gonna be slightly to get up into it should be going to be taken up to 4000 RPM. It's a lower RPM for just identity for just going to be taking for very much. How this absolutely in the previous video, the acceleration of this vehicle was way too slow than I ever expected around for this one. So all you have to do is got to be reaching up to 4000 RPM. If this is absolutely necessary to get up until as well, and looks like we're going to be reaching up to its maximum capacity as well. So it is not an interstate highway. And because of all of this sudden, that must be an autobahn as well. So I suggest we're going to be hitting out to the gear 1. And I just might slightly going to be overheating for my engine. This is the way that must be stops over here. The US bus as well. And then there's some kind of gas station over here. Which is absolutely going to be trying to refuel the cars. And some kind of US cars as well. And by moving on. And to take all of this way. To gear 6. And which is absolutely the final gear drive. And that must be seeing no railroad tracks as well. And seeing by this one. That must be the turn of this going to be determined all the way down here. So absolutely I have for a safe highway drive. All the way through. And looks like we're just going to be coming up for just instantly hitting around for the gear 3. And it looks like we're just going to be continuing accelerating up through here into 5000 RPM. And fourth gear, it's going to be taking very slow. But we never pretty seen the sun that before it's going to be slept. Where's the sun? It wasn't really here for just like I do so. And it's going to be taking for a little bit tweaks. And about to get around for 65 miles an hour. And what it is, I'm just going to be changing into some kind of down to 60 miles an hour. And it looks like we're just going to be reaching up to 100 kilometers an hour. Which is pretty slow than I ever expected. And around for just a couple of matter of weeks. It's just going to be taking for very much longer than it would have able to do like this one. So I suggest I'm just going to be moving around for the highway drive and around for these vehicles in the passing lane with all of these trucks. But somehow it's going to be taking for 103 kilometers an hour, slowing down for just a little bit. 110 studs per second and reaching about to down all the way that I never able to guess. Hitting around to 65 miles an hour, that should be going to be taking for very much longer. And that is going to be the safest car that I ever expected. Now it's taking for just a little bit slow. Around three I'm out of weeks. And I can see for other kinds of highway. So we're just going to be taking around for the exit. For a literally first. Now take it on to a neutral. And getting on to the highway as fast as possible. So we're going to be taking around for the exit. And today, we won't absolutely going to be taking for very much as well. And we just lost power for the RPM. I think we need some kind of a morbidly horsepower required. 
Now it looks like even the acceleration is got to be extremely slow. Now we're going to be reached up to high in 6,000 RPM. Is this other the end of the road? I think we're just going to be slightly going to be went into the left side of the road. Now we're off into some other kinds of this one by using a 2003 Honda Odyssey. And it's currently made in Japan, banned in Forza. And by using for a 2017 Honda Odyssey. And I can see other the end of the road. I think that was absolutely it. And in case I'm going to be turning all the headlights on. And I'm probably sure all cars are no longer powerful. And because due to something for a weak power, I have to head back home before it won't be going to be too late for each one. So I'm just going to be starting around to speed. And there is no interior in about the onboard view because due to subject that is won't be absolutely going to be taking for very much. If this is absolutely going to be started to hit the wall, maybe we will find out. It won't be going to be very worse than this is enormous mysterious one as well. So let me just get to be checking in here. It's just a wall. But unfortunately, we're going to be heading back. But all of a sudden, it wasn't going to be pretty good as well. So I'm just going to be taking around for it. And so, to the other side of the highway. Not pretty good, I guess. The sun is absolutely pretty setting down. And it's the night highway drive. Return back home into one exactly one thing that I just never able to do. And I'm just gonna be taking around for the exit, and there must be walls around here for just a little bit. And but got pretty for just a little bit for one something like else. Hitting around for 80 miles an hour, 81 miles an hour. Just gonna be taking around slow, taking for just a very much. Not quite a little bit. 85 miles an hour can lose your bonus while you're trucking or something kind of a bus. Now, it's gonna be probably never able to say what we're gonna be trying to do like this. It's absolutely I'm started to speed all over and to take it for this a little bit advantage to get over to this one as the Honda Odysseys have been imported to United States, which is probably good. For some kind of and other kinds of family cars in the US. Californian style is absolutely pretty for a very important see that I can see Daihatsu trucks all the way around here. Turning them abandoned. It's gotta be quickly gone too far. So all you have to do, there must be the exit over here. So it looks like we're gonna be taking for very slow down. If this is absolutely for some kind of walls wait everything is walls everywhere so all you have to do is gonna be driving a very slow until it's not gonna be very nice and although it's not gonna be taken very seriously but all of a sudden this vehicle might went down the fuel I think there is no connections about this thing so all you have to do is gonna be reversing back and gonna be taking all of this sudden it's not going to be going too powerful as well. All cars are not powerful. Not except trucks. It's literally possible. It's because of inside of Truck and Tuesday. This is going to be taking for various wacky things as well. Hitting out to max out with 6500 RPM. And it's going to be taking around for this. We're going to be end of this video. And about to going up here. So if this is absolutely pretty possible. And looks like I got a little bit amount of bounties for speeding. That's just going to be pretty without for just a little bit. Some kind of just one thing. Overall, we're going to be about to end of this video before morning. This is what absolutely to take in very terrifying like these things. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be taking around for our parking stage. Behind for some kind of a North Asian cars. Was absolutely a little bit good. So I just suggest I get to be turning off the headlights and the car just absolutely stuff. And if you just like for today's video and some kind of in Japan viewers, leave a like and subscribe if you want to drive somewhere in some cars inside Japan in game. Now it looks like 
that I should be moving out to Midnight Racing for some day. Thanks for watching. That which will be Jeffrey Concept signing off. That was pretty intensely no weird at all. And because of this, all of this ones, I wasn't able to say like this before. And I absolutely gotta be returning home for literally right now. And that's because that I just gotta be taken for a little bit of tweaks of about for this moment. So even I just gotta be taking around for its manual transmission. I'm sorry that this is gonna be taken for a little bit much, but unfortunately that is should be taking around over 15 minutes. And about to get down on this strategy, but looks like we're just gonna be taking around for various speeds. And about for a little bit for just only one thing. And the car is overheated. That I never able to say. So it started to get a pull out. And I can see the construction site. Everything is under development. And about for just only one thing. That the game is linked in the description down below. So you can check it out. And try to play this thing. So I just hopefully that is the end of this video. And I'm going to be talking you guys over and out. I mean some kind of. Even I'll see you later, Cookie Runners, into our next video. Until it's absolutely saying for about for cheer out. So it won't be gonna be absolutely necessary at all. And that's the final. And it won't be gonna be taking for very much a North Asian cars or just like even for buying for used cars like this or something. So the good thing is and this is absolutely pretty just is gonna be saying for a fully thumbs up of this video.